what's up guys? Good morning. Another vlog for you guys today. A little bit of dethatching work. Alright, so if you guys can see right here, we've got the Toro Grandstand, the multi-force. We still got the bagger attachment to it, and we've got the front dethatcher. This is new to me, so we're learning together today. Let's check it out. Alright guys, so like I said, we've got the multi-force with the dethatcher. Can you cut that? This is uh newer offering from Toro with the uh, dethatching unit as well that's a part of the setup so same thing goes in here with the ram right goes right in here the little hitch pin this is the uh, low flow hydraulics and as you guys can tell we're making a mess so it rained last night not the most ideal conditions all this is uh, the dethatching that kind of flicked out we've got some good GoPro footage we just captured for you guys uh, we gotta blow all this back into the yard uh, so you can see that it raked and all the tines went through to pull up the thatch Now we don't want to pull up too much thatch out of here uh, But this is the first one that we're using with this new setup so far. It's working out. Yeah, it looks pretty clean It's pretty Seems clean. It works well seeing that I've never used one before in my life. So yeah, can you pop that top? I want to see what it, we took away from the front yard. Uh, we did a pass back and forth up and down What do we got here? Like half. Oh wow, so that's a lot more than I thought so that's just from the front yard. So the setup that we have here is we dethatch and it bags at the same time. Um, can you jump on, start it up, and then we'll just show these guys how it works up and down? Hey, if you guys are appreciating this video, big thumbs up. Uh, dethatching, you know, a lot of guys will talk about doing it in the spring. A lot of people talk about doing it in the fall. The reality is that if you're up here in the Midwest, we, we side discharge, the grass just biodegrades, right? Well, over time, sometimes the yards get a little yellow, a little matted, a little bit of extra thatch. It's a widely popular thing where we live. Uh, we don't include it personally with our spring cleanups. Uh, it's an extra service. I know a lot of you guys do. Is that something you guys include with your regular spring cleanups? I know some of you guys do. Uh, but for us, we got a couple of dethatchings we had to do today and the rest of uh, this week. So here we go. Uh, can you set that up? Yep. My man. Uh, rev it up. So one thing we were noticing, uh, we just made a quick adjustment because uh, I'm like, oh my God, there's a way to adjust this. And I'm learning. There is a uh, little Allen wrench, uh, you know, screw here. And this was uh, allowing us to take the peg and bring it up a little higher, which I was just doing this detachment. I said, I wish it went down a little bit lower. Well, I guess this is the, uh, the height adjustment. So now when the ram pushes it all the way down, hopefully this is uh, going to give us an extra half inch of having these tines poke into the grass and help us out. So pretty straightforward design, pretty simple. Like I said, we uh, did it on both sides here. Um, I don't know, I'd love to hear you guys' thoughts. If you guys run the multi-force with the uh, dethatcher, let me know how you guys like it. And for those of you guys that do the dethatchings, there's some money on them for sure. By the way, this is a dream setup for sure. You get the dethatcher and the power bagger. Like that was one of the exact reasons I said, sure, I'll check this thing out because we get so many requests for dethatchings. Um, and you know, why, why not make the money with it, amen? All right, well let's capture uh, some, we got some GoPro footage that we already did for the front and uh, we'll keep this going and show you guys it, uh, more in action.
I've never seen anything. I, I think it's pretty dope that you can dethatch and have the bagger on. I mean, it just makes sense. So that took uh, the better part of 20 minutes. Nothing crazy. Obviously, trailer park lots my mom's property. Got to take care of mom. Uh, let me show you guys inside. So this is uh, basically one bag of dethatched grass. And again, we don't want to take too much out. Uh, we just want to kind of open up the lawn a little bit. Uh, but this is this looks a lot better. And I noticed that when we drop those casters down a little bit more or raise them up or whatever way you look at it, uh, the front unit was able to penetrate into the grass a little bit more. So to me, that's a win. And uh, that's what I got for you guys today. So if you guys got any helpful tips or comments on dethatching, love to uh, hear them down in the comment section down below. But you got the multi-force dethatcher, you got the multi-force bagger. That's a great combo. That's a great setup. That's a money-making opportunity right there. So, all right, guys. Well, hey, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and like the video if you guys enjoyed it. And we'll catch up with you on the next one.